Hey YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to make a fake MSN hack or a fake other problem, other program in Microsoft Visual Basic 2008 Express Edition. To start off, go to File, New Project, select Windows Forms Application, type Windows Live Messenger Hack. So this is basically the form. To change the text, <coughs> this is the text. Uh, change it to MSN hat to hack 2010. Go to form borrow style and click fix it to window so it it isn't feasible. We should have a picture like to make it. To make the victims believe that it's a real MSN hack, go to picture box, next on the middle, on the center, go to image, local source, import, and import your your MSN logo or other image. This is mine, I downloaded it from Google. Put it right there. Add one. Add one uh, button, I mean add two buttons. Make it to fit the image on the one, uh, make the buttons a little smaller or a little bigger, it's up to you. On the first button, type. Click uh double click on it and type M and B box message box and type your MSN password is trusted. Please click on the button show password and change the name of it Kratk Fast. On the other button, click, uh, double click on it, type message box. The password is note that this is not a real password, it's just a fake password to make the victims more to make the victims believe that you have like the right MSN hack. You can add a checkbox here, like if you want to write a uh, freeze MSN. Go to text box, text box. This is the text box make a little text box make it here write the victims msn change the name of the second button to show password And this is basically the the fake program. Now to test it, go to start debugging and like the victims MSN type like Nori HS and at hotmail.com. He will probably click freeze MSN and please collect the password. Your MSN password is correct. Please check the button show password. The password is H J S A A J S or something like that. Uh, when you enter to the to the message box, so you will probably try to log in with the with the with the email with, uh, with the same password that we gave it to him, but he will not be able to log in. So this is basically the fake MSN program.
or hack now to save it go to file save all click on my documents msn hack one or msn hack click save now the whole project is saved to make it like an application click the back click build click build windows live and messenger hack build succeeded open my documents my documents and go to obg go to release and this is our when you open it it's just the same as the one we made in the visual basic so you can bind that with mailer or not bind it and uh, in you will have like more victims but the thing is if you have a better design of replication more victims will, will come and they will believe more like it's it's more legit or something like that so this is what you basically need to do to make a fake windows live messenger application so feel free to comment right and subscribe to my to my channel and register at anarchy zone goodbye